It's a big day for Cannon Hall Farm favourite Blossom and her handler Farmer Ruth as they prepare to enter the ring at the Pennison Agricultural Show. It's the final show of the year and Ruth's last chance to show off what Blossom has to offer. Hi guys, Farmer Ruth here from Cannon Hall Farm. Exciting day, we're at the Pennington Showground. We're just getting Blossom ready. Uh, just starting doing a tail and we'll move on to a main. Very nervous. Uh, this is the first time out I've been with her uh, since the Yorkshire show and since I injured myself. So I'm quite nervous because I've got to do a lot with her uh, and I hope I don't let her down. Uh, but so far so good, she's doing okay. Um, she's been absolutely spot on this morning. Uh, she's just fidgeting a little bit now, but that's fine. Not a problem while she's eating her breakfast. So we're going to get this tail finished off and then we're going to move on to her main and get her all plotted up and we're ready to go. I'm quite nervous, but I'm very excited as well. I'm just happy to be out with her. Um, what she does in the ring is obviously, it does matter, but it's not, winning is not the end game. It's a going out and experiencing all these things. And for me, it's making sure I can, I can do that. Obviously, this will be the first big test of, of my leg. Uh, at a showground and, and running out and uh, not being able to stop um, so I've got to carry it through so we'll uh, we'll see what we do but I'm sure we'll be fine don't we babe this is the last show of the year so we won't be going out again after this but that doesn't mean her training will stop we will still continue with the training we will still continue with platting up for her patience for my platting skills uh, we'll still go and do trotting out as you know at the Yorkshire show she didn't want to back up um, that is still a bit of her vice, uh, but we'll, uh, we'll see what she does today. With final preparations finished, it's very nearly time for a nervous farmer Ruth to step up and head into the ring. Uh, nerves are kicking in now, I've got uh, a bit of a tummy ache and whatnot, but it's all nerves. Stand up, put your head up. Now we just need to keep her head up because uh, she's just started putting her head down a little bit and she's, uh, she's pulling her plaits. So I need to do some uh, remedial work there uh, and then we'll be in the ring. So we're, we're just watching now, we're just waiting for other classes to finish and the shires to start and then it's uh, all hands to the battle front then, isn't it? With everything done, it's finally time for Horse and Handler to head off and see what the judge thinks. With competition from only one other horse, it's giving the expert judge plenty of time to consider exactly what he's looking for. Arguably, the most difficult part of the judging is the dreaded run out, where both horse and handler have to run in length of the ring to show off the control and movement of the horse. But Blossom's Achilles heel has always been her refusal to walk backwards for the judge. But today, she smashed it. However, Today is not Blossom's day and she's taken second place behind a very, very deserving horse and handler. But it's been a fantastic performance from this Cannon Hall Farm favourite. I'm really, really pleased with that. Um, she's, she's been waiting over an hour, she's got fed up um, and she's run out really, really well. She was very nervous throughout. Um, there were a lot of people, a lot of people talking, a lot of movement down low and she did really well. And best of all, she backed up, which is fantastic. Now she's very fed up now. She wants these flights out. So we're going to strip her down now and uh, let her have the rest of the day eating hay. But yeah, very well done, Blossom. Good girl.